If you drove through Lee's Summit today, you probably hit a roadblock. Eric Schultz shows us what was going on and why all the streets were shut down. There was no getting through today. These cars were turned away from downtown Lee's Summit. Turned away for this. They're in the car. Bottle goes up. A movie. Then Frankie can take his own cue. Come, right Come back. back. A big screen production right here in the heartland. This is a big full feature movie. And uh, half of the cast is uh, from Kansas City as far as the local people. The main actors are from L.A. But this production company is based in KC. They want to establish Kansas City as a movie-making hub, and they want to do it making family-friendly films, like this one. Its title is Three Blind Saints. It's about three guys that uh, get thrown into the church world. They're not church guys. A collision of cultures making for some funny scenes. There's some comedy, some drama, and a serious message. I know I have two daughters myself, and I'm always conscious of things that we go see, and I, and, and I know there's been times that I've sat with my daughters and been a little in it's why he came here for this project, even though he's worked with big stars in Hollywood like Robert Duvall, Tom Cruise, and Sandra Bullock. This location does have its quirks. This production crew says they really do like filming here, but as you can hear in the background, there's a few things to this location that are unique. Like the trains that come through and interrupt filming several times a day. But this crew just rolls with it, hoping this family-friendly production from the heartland is a hit. Eric Schultz, NBC Action News. Bring it, baby. I'm waiting for sound. Filming for three blind states will continue for a couple of weeks in Lee Summit, Kansas City, and Independence. They expect to release it sometime next year.